you don't learn how to swim, you are in danger of drowning. And the best way to learn swimming is first learning the basics. In this video, I will discuss the most important skill in learning swimming, and that is floating. But how do people float? As long as the water your body displaces weighs more than you do, you float. This is in short, the Archimedes Law. A human submerged in water weighs less and is less dense than the water itself because the lungs are full of air like a balloon. And like a balloon, the air in the lungs lifts you to the surface naturally. And these are the five types of float. The first type is the prone float. A prone position is lying in your abdomen, while a streamlined position is placing your hand over your hand, fingers over your fingers, and raising your arms above your head so the biceps are tucked close to the ears. To perform a prone float, perform a prone lying position while doing a streamlined position and spreading your lower extremities. The second type is the supine float. A supine position is lying on your back. To perform a supine float, perform a supine lying position while spreading the upper extremities and keeping lower extremities together. The third type is the dead man's or starfish float. To perform the dead man's or starfish float, perform a prone lying position while spreading your upper and lower extremities in the water, imitating the starfish. The fourth type is the egg float or tuck float. To do this, tuck your chin to your chest and grab your legs together and hold your breath for a couple of seconds. Little by little, you will eventually float in the water. And lastly, the fifth type is the jellyfish float. To perform this, tuck your chin to your chest and hold your chin. Hold your breath for a couple of seconds. Little by little, you will eventually float in the water. And that's the five types of float. We have a prone float, a supine float, a dead man's or starfish float, an egg float or a tack float, and a jellyfish float. The ability to float in the water is a basic skill that allows swimmers to rest while staying in the water. It is also a critical survival skill for swimming in open water. For this reason alone, it is often one of the first techniques taught the young swimmers. And that's all for today. See you in our next video. Adios!